All right, ladies and gentlemen, big pizza video today. Papa John's, we got the deluxe special right here. We got wings, we got pizza to try for all you guys. But first things first, obviously we gotta try the pizza. I'm gonna have to rest the wings right over yawns. All right, but before we, actually I wanna show you guys the pizza first before we read any reviews. So we got one other sealed, hold on. Let me crack this seal for y'all. But very, very big, big, big episode for y'all. Very excited. I personally really like Papa John's. So hopefully they can deliver today. But we're gonna see, we're gonna see for sure. Just doing a little pizza review video, yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> and let's so yeah, that, that was the first pizza. And this is our second pizza right here. I don't know what I'm gonna try for you guys on camera. Probably just gonna play it. But we're probably gonna try this one first, to be honest. This pepperoni and cheese. So before we try anything though, I do want to read some reviews. So this restaurant is a 3.8 on Google. For some reason, all of our big franchise pizza restaurants in the area, Domino's, Papa John's, Hungry Howie's, they're all in the threes. And I don't like, I don't know why my, my area just, I don't know. They be slacking, they be slacking. But let's read some reviews guys. First things first, let's get her done. So first we got Robin Gordon. Robin says, I love Papa John's pizza, but I just saw they do not wear gloves. The young lady was pulling the chicken out with her bare hands. Hell no. COVID is still relevant and these young people are handling the food with no gloves. This is my last pizza from them. So yeah, we did peep that they weren't wearing any gloves when they were like handling the pizza. Personally, I don't care. To be honest, like food is food at the end of the day. It gets cooked anyways. The, the bacteria gets fried off, but I understand where she's coming from. And this was seven months ago, so it makes sense. Then we got Jose Hernandez. Jose says, if you want your pizza cold and delivered in two hours, this is the right place to order. Damn, Pizza Hut is faster and has better deals. $40, 40-something $40 dollar bill, including tips for cold old pizza. Ugh. Well, the pizza doesn't feel cold, so that's good. That's that's a good thing, at least. I mean, maybe it's because we didn't order delivery. And then let's do let's do this last review, though. So we got Semeron. Now, this one has me a little on edge. I, this was four years ago, though, so the things might have changed. I ordered pizza from this place and my kid found a fingernail in her pizza. If he used gloves, this would never have. Oh my God, bro. Let's just try it, bro. I'm super excited for this pizza, bro. After those like crazy ass reviews, this shit has to be good. Honestly, it does look a little underwhelming in my opinion. Um, it doesn't look like the craziest, but hey, I'll be the judge of that. I'm gonna I'm actually, all right, here's what we're gonna do today. You guys know how the wings are. We're here to try the pizza, you know what I'm saying? So we're gonna, we're gonna do the pepperoni slice first and then we're gonna do a pineapple slice right after. One slice, everybody knows the rules. What happened? What's going on? Everything good behind the camera? You might wanna step forward a little bit. Step forward? What happened? If you good, keep going. Everything's good? All right. Yeah. Mm. Pretty good. Cuz. Oh shit. The crust is surprising me. Yo, low key. This kind of tastes like an upgraded Chuck E. Cheese pizza, if that makes any sense to you guys. But let's let's grab another bite here. Cause you guys Cause you guys know we only review pepperoni pizza on the channel. Um and yeah, we review other pizzas, but the pepperoni pizza is what really takes the cake for the whole review of the place. Um, but so far, so good, not too bad. Mm. So, the pepperoni, it's not as strong, but you do taste it, it's very subtle. Now the sauce, you kinda taste the sauce, you kinda taste the cheese, so you kinda taste everything, but it's very minimal, at least at my location. Uh, guys, if you wanna see us try Papa John's again, we can, um, and Domino's, same thing, but like for what it is, I think I'm probably gonna give it a 7-3. Honestly, this is hitting like a 7-3. Um, not a not a bad score by any means but yo guys my favorite pizza right here pineapple pizza you guys already know we got to try it on video though i gotta try it this is already a 10 out of 10 baby mm. oh pineapple's hitting bro if you guys remember the domino's pizza bro same thing like when we tried the second pizza the alfredo pizza it was so much better this Another case of that, the pineapple takes the cake on that one. I'll probably get a pineapple of 7.6. Really, really good score for Papa John's. Honestly, guys, um, I, I don't want to say they surprised me because I honestly expected like somewhere in the eights for Papa John's because Papa John's, like, 
you know we, we know we know how papa john's is growing up and stuff like this was this was it bro like papa john's was it but ever since they turned corporate and stuff too but it's not just that it's also just like our location you know what i'm saying like that's why i say we probably got to try papa john's again in the near or later future but guys if you guys enjoy my bad my bad my bad have food in my mouth i'm still talking like an idiot bro if you guys enjoy these videos these videos are really raw which i like because i can't mess up i gotta continue talking throughout it no matter what but if you guys are enjoying these videos definitely subscribe to the channel definitely stay tuned and let me know if you guys do enjoy these videos because i love these pizza videos bro i love them i'll catch you guys